Pisces. Hey Pisces, welcome back to my channel. And this is the week ahead reading for the sign of Pisces. If you're new to my channel, I pray before each and every one of my readings so that way my energy is protected, your energy is protected as well. If you're returning, thank you so much for returning and trust me with your energy. So, so the first message we have here is massive realization. Hmm. Wow, I just got exposed. So I'm tapping into a connection that is currently under the energy of exposure, whether you know it or not. And honestly, this energy is coming through from a masculine who's ready to have a deeper access to you. There's something very raw about their energy as well. So this is someone who's very, very deep. And they like to know everything about the person that they're with. So right now, you're their focus, Divine Feminine. So if there's anything that you've been holding back, this masculine is actively seeking a deeper level of access to you. And they're not coming directly to you for this. They're taking a more spiritual approach. So they may be praying or even tapping into your energy telepathically to access this information. And this is bringing them massive clarity about you. But this is not about the person that you present to them. This is a part of yourself that you hide intentionally. Wow, that just came through clearly. So this is definitely tapping into a deeper aspect of your being. What's also interesting is that this masculine actually views you as a very open and honest feminine energy. So the fact that they're even doing this means that they feel like there's a part of you that you just will not give them access to. And this frustrates them. And it's actually driving their actions at this time. So if you're wondering how your person is currently receiving this guidance about you, the energy is not coming through in a malicious way at all, okay? Your person only has this level of access to you because they are your divine counterpart, okay? So there could be something that you did in a recent past that really did not sit right with them. And now they're questioning you, which is very odd for this connection. I'm picking up on something that's very solid. So this is a masculine that views you as someone who's very, very straightforward. But something has shifted in the energy and it's making them literally want to dissect you from the inside out. So no matter how you are presenting right now, Divine Feminine, they want what's under that. They want the real you, okay? Your real emotion, your real expression. Um, maybe they feel like you're holding back from them a little bit. And maybe you have a very good reason for that. But to be honest, they're not concerned with your reasons at all, okay? Um, this energy with this masculine is coming through very blunt, very raw, okay? Um, they're focused on the truth right now. There's a lot of energy coming through here. So this usually means that your person is processing some very intense emotions at this time. And if you're wondering how your masculine is currently viewing your connection, it feels really restricted to them. Your person feels like you may be hiding something and they feel like you're doing this intentionally, okay? But this wasn't always the case here. And so they ask for assistance from a higher power to reveal the truth to them about you. And I mean the whole truth, okay? So this is unfiltered, like no sugarcoating at all. And the information that they are receiving is very shocking. I'm also getting that they weren't expecting to come across this information in the way that it's being presented. So no matter what you're showing them right now, they're more focused on what's beneath that because they feel like that's where the truth is. But I keep getting the word more, okay? So they want more of you. And they went straight to the source to have this access. And I'm getting it was granted to them only because of who they are to you, okay? Wow, so this message may be very specific because 
I'm getting that it's, it's like really straightforward energy, okay? Very direct, very blunt, very serious. So I feel like this may be for a very particular feminine energy, okay? Let's get the next message here. Wow. So the next message we have is you trigger me often. Yeah. There's something very real about this energy here. Almost as if this masculine is tired of playing surface with you, Divine Feminine. There's also heavy marrying happening at this time. And this is definitely tapping into the deepest parts of your souls. I just got warning very, very clearly. So the insight that they're receiving came with a warning as well. And it feels like the reason that your person is being warned is because this may drive your masculine to do something very shocking, okay? Divine Feminine, your person views you as someone who's very confident, but the way your energy is coming off recently, there's a lot that you've been holding back from your person as it pertains to your emotions. And you may have a very good reason for this, but it's triggering them because they know you to be very vocal and honest. And what's interesting is that you both are completely marrying one another at this time because I'm getting that you've been holding back the fact that they are a huge trigger for you in some way. And you feel this way because they bring out a totally different side of you. So although there's a lot of love you have for them, there are things that this masculine makes you feel that no other masculine energy has even come close to. And this is on every level. So physically, mentally, emotionally, and sexually. This feminine energy that I'm picking up on may even be a little afraid of the intensity of this connection because it's unlike anything you've ever felt before and in a way that excites you, but it also terrifies you, I'm getting. And this may actually have you responding to your masculine in a way that doesn't really reflect what you feel on the inside. And these emotions that you feel are valid and very common in this type of dynamic. So you're connected to a masculine energy that you feel like is literally everything that you have ever wanted. This is something that you can't just turn away from. And I'm getting that you've tried plenty of times. The energy coming through in this reading is so intense, okay? And honestly, it feels like the solar eclipse energy is actually helping your masculine to see things that have been hidden from them when it comes to you, okay? This type of energy is very rare. It's bold and it also taps into the shadow as well. So the solar eclipse energy has the ability to highlight the lower aspects of our beings, our hopes, our wishes, and also our fears, okay? And this is what they're pulling from you right now. So you may feel their energy around you at this time, but in a very intimate type of way. And this is definitely giving them a deeper insight into what acts as a barrier to your connection. It's almost as if this is someone who really is seeking to understand you. So at this time, they're going beneath the surface because whatever it is that you're presenting is simply not enough for them. They need solid, substantial information. So this may not be for everyone, but this is definitely tapping into a connection that's expanding spiritually. Also a connection that's very in tune with the universe because I'm getting something clearly about this solar eclipse energy. Um, so it means that your connection is very, very connected with you know, the planetary bodies, the, the different transitions that's happening on the planet, it almost affects you like you both are very sensitive to the energies on the planet, okay? So yeah, right now your person is definitely exploring the unknown. They're asking a lot of questions and just assuming a very curious role in life. And right now you're the topic that they're choosing to kind of dissect in this way, okay? What's also sticking out here is that your masculine is not someone who does something without reason, okay? Especially when it comes to you and especially when it comes to matters of their heart. 
So it's important that you know that they're being guided through this process because they're tapping into a very sacred part of you, Divine Feminine. And I feel like that's tapping into that warning energy as well. It's almost like, you know, their higher power is letting them know, like, you can have access to this information, but be very careful what you do with it, okay? This energy is really, really intense. <laughs> Let's get the next message here. Okay. So the next message we have is the grass wasn't greener. Wow. This is a very interesting connection, okay? And this masculine in your energy field is really, really digging deep. I say that because the energy with this card here is usually tied to masculine energy. And it points to a masculine who kind of attempts to leave the connection only to find that the grass wasn't greener. But Divine Feminine, your energy is coming through with this card here. So this may be another truth bomb that's coming through. This may actually be what your person is tapping into. And this honestly has them mind blown. Simply based on how you present yourself or just how you carry yourself in general. I'm picking up on a feminine energy that just really has this regal type of aura, okay? Which naturally makes you very selective in what you give of yourself when it comes to masculine energy in general. But your masculine is learning that this wasn't the case for them. Divine Feminine, if you were to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with your masculine, about everything, you would let them know that you broke all the rules for them, okay? And I keep getting specific, so this is definitely for a very specific feminine energy. This may not resonate with everyone, but there's a certain way in which you live your life. Maybe this was like more conservative, um, but I'm getting that there were things that happened in this in this connection that you never thought that would happen. Things you never thought you would do, things you never thought you would say. There's some type of deep contrast as it pertains to you and your masculine. But the way this energy is coming through, they activated something in you that's extremely freeing, but also extremely terrifying to you, okay? This is how the energy is coming through. This is truly this connection has truly been an awakening of your soul. And this type of energy is only reserved for your divine masculine because there's no other masculine energy that can handle you in this way. But they want you to know that although this kind of comes as a complete shock to them, this energy that you've been stuffing down is actually what they have been missing from you. There's also something that was activated when you met that makes you both come alive. And this is why they've been praying and asking questions because there may have been something that happened within this connection that caused the momentum to slow down a bit. And this has been really hard for them to navigate. So everything that you've been holding back as far as your emotions and what you really want from them, they now have access to, okay? And they're about to make a very bold move in your direction. But they're also being cautious because this energy is powerful and very, very sacred. So the timing of this is significant as well. They feel as if this has to be right, okay? They feel like they have to be on point. So not only on the timing, but the way in which they approach you as well. Because I'm getting clearly that this is not something they're going to say to you. They're not going to tell you what it is that they know. This is something that their energy will communicate to you, almost as if they're reading your mind, almost as if they just have such a deeper level of, you know, connection to you energetically, which is very familiar to you, Divine Feminine, because I'm getting a lot of intuitive energy where you literally have access to your Divine Masculine, and you may wonder if they have access to you too. They now do, okay? Okay. This is actually opening a door for much deeper expression because it's almost as if there will be nothing to hide. 
And this energy is extremely powerful because it's literally knocking down anything that was a barrier to your transparency. So the level of intensity that you both have been running from is now what your souls are going to be running toward. So you're someone who is held in very high regard, Divine Feminine, and a lot of masculine energies may be drawn to you, but naturally you're just attracted to powerful energy. What's even more shocking about what your person is discovering about you is that they didn't expect you to view them in the same way that they view you. This is a very mutual connection, but there's a lot that has gone unsaid, okay? You both kind of have put one another in a category that surpasses anything you've ever experienced before. And so your masculine has been praying for clarity about you in an attempt to justify what they have always felt, okay? They've always felt that this was the truth about you, but now they have proof, okay, that this connection is different. And I'm getting that you both feel this in a very, very real way at this time. Let's get the next message here. Okay, so the next message we have is eye contact. Yeah. I just got souls don't meet on accident. That just came through very clearly here. And anytime the eye contact card comes out, this is pointing to a very deep energetic bond. One that was realized and even activated very early on. But although this is often seen as such a beautiful, powerful, highly spiritual aspect of this connection, I feel like this reading here is speaking to another aspect that also drives this connection, okay? And the solar eclipse energy is very relevant here. It's shining a light on the shadow aspect of your connection and the journey in general. So this could be a little triggering, okay? You may feel very intense emotions um, rising to the surface, okay? Because when we get into the shadow, it literally taps into the part of the psyche that you don't even know is there. So there are certain ways of being that are embedded in you that drive how you live your life, how you move, and in this case, how you love. So when you tap into the territory of the soul, you're truly playing on an entirely different timeline. This connection is literally shifting your entire perspective on true intimacy and also unconditional love because it's giving you a level of access that's unlike anything you've ever experienced. So Divine Feminine, your masculine wants you to know that everything in you that makes you wanna hide from them is what their soul was drawn to from the very beginning, okay? This is someone who immediately wanted to know everything about you because of this deep resonance that they really couldn't understand. This also could have played into the hot and cold energy that I'm picking up on within this dynamic as well, okay? It's like you get really comfy with someone because they feel like home, but then you pull back because you wonder why and how, you know, does this person feel like home to you? Especially if they feel like the connection hasn't hit certain milestones or if they're judging the timeline in a very linear kind of way here, okay? This can be a very eerie feeling, especially for your masculine. So in order for them to know just how deep this thing is, they have to know what truly lies beneath all of this. What's also being highlighted here is that this is not a fear of the worst. Okay, this is actually healthy fear. And what you both may not know is that nothing in this connection is an accident. Everything happened as it should. I'm also getting that there's something absolutely breathtaking about the eye contact that you share. It may also be a huge trigger for you both because it makes you feel things that you've never felt before. Okay, it may also feel like Something in you is being activated when this happens, okay? I hope this is coming across clearly, but you will know if, you, if you've ever looked into the eyes of your twin flame. It's almost as if once this happened, it changes you forever. So what's sticking out here is that when this happened, you both were no longer able to settle. 
And this is where that fear may have come in. And what lies beneath that fear is the truth. And that's you don't really want anyone else. Even if you have moments where you have to detach, this connection that I'm picking up on, nothing comes close to this, okay? Um, like literally every other connection pales in comparison to this. And that's extremely beautiful, but also scary just due to the natural, you know, progression of this connection, the phases that you have to go through, um, the moments where you pull really close to one another, but then for some reason, <laughs> the universe separates you, okay? Um, very, very triggering type of energy. I feel like this is definitely touching on some of those pain points that come up within the twin flame dynamic. Let's get the next message here. The next message we have is, I'm ready to face you. Yeah. If you're wondering why your masculine is embarking on this journey to kind of uncover the real raw truth about your connection, it's because they're no longer afraid of the intensity that you make them feel, okay? I'm also picking up on this heavy energy of projection. And this happens a lot in this dynamic where the masculine energy will feel intense, triggering emotions. And instead of going within and looking within themselves, oftentimes they will hold that mirror up to you, Divine Feminine. You literally act as a mirror to them, okay? And I'm getting that the intensity of this connection is the one thing that has had such a powerful hold on them when it comes to you. And they wonder why and if they're alone in this feeling about you. They're now finding out that your story or the way you align is very, very telling. So the type of emotions you experience on the twin flame journey are so intense that there's literally no words to describe them, okay? It makes you feel totally exposed, but also safe. It makes you feel seen, but it can also be very scary for another person to be so triggering to your nervous system, for a single thought to stop you in your tracks, or to even make your body react to them from a distance. There are a lot of rare occurrences that you're subject to when you are chosen for this journey. And it's not something that you can turn off. And this is the energy of a masculine who maybe tried to turn this off many, many times. But this energy we're under is currently bringing so much to the light. This may feel a little bit uncomfortable for you both. It may even feel like you're being exposed in a major way, okay, if you're really tapped into this. I'm also getting that your masculine is feeling this very intensely. So this is that energy of projection and the energy of exposure. This is definitely tapping into the lower octave of this connection and how it can be a huge trigger in deciding how you interpret the energy. It's heavy, okay? But I'm getting that whatever is happening right now behind the scenes and this connection, what's happening with your masculine is very important, okay? Whatever is happening, whatever they're having access to, it needs to be exposed because once this energy clears, it's going to feel so much lighter. This is a very intense connection because you mirror one another in a major way. So when you feel intense emotions like this, it's really due to your person. And lately your masculine has been feeling your energy pulling on them, but this was from a different place, okay? It was from the soul. It was from your astral body. You may not be aware of this, Divine Feminine, but... Whatever it is that they're coming into um, is really helping their approach. There's been this deep desire to move your connection forward, but there was also this energy of repression on both sides. And this eclipse energy is coming through to clear this in a major way. So if you're wondering why your person has been so heavy on your mind, this is why, okay? I'm also getting that you both have been receiving very direct signs like names, birthdays, having dreams, okay? Your person is ready to face you, Divine Feminine. And when they do, okay, their level of confidence will speak volumes, okay? To have this validation that they have is such a game changer. 
So what's also sticking out here is that there's this energy of exclusivity that your person was really seeking confirmation on. It's like they really needed to know that you felt the same way as them, that you have them in their own little category the same way that they have you, okay? This connection is one that literally broke all of your rules. And so if you've been feeling such a heavy energy of restraint when it comes to your masculine, this was simply your energies being reflected back to one another in very different ways. So there's momentum building in this connection and this energy continues to shift. Um, your masculine is definitely drawn closer and closer to you. For some of you, this could be physically. For others of you, this can be energetically, depending on where you are on your journey, okay? Let's go ahead and get the last message here. Wow. So the last message we have is, I'm going to change your mind. Like I said, this masculine's energy is coming through very, very bold, very, very straightforward, like literally no cut cards, okay? And I feel like this is their overall goal. This may just be giving you the inside look of their mental process, how it is they're viewing you, how it is they're viewing your connection. Also, what are their plans for you as well, okay? So it's almost like they're trying to get into your mind, Divine Feminine, in order to change the physical aspect of this connection, to change how you view them as well, okay? They also desire to show you that they can handle you. This is not a masculine energy that desires to suppress you in any kind of way. This is not someone who is intimidated by your energy. This masculine that you're connected to, I feel like the overall energy is them coming through saying, I can handle the intensity, okay? And they plan on showing you this in a very real way. This is why they needed to get to the root of what's causing you to hold back from them. They feel this from you, Divine Feminine, the same way that you can feel their energy. So this is a very mutual connection. There's very real, powerful very, very intense energy, feelings, emotions that have not been tapped into. This may be very surface kind of energy here. This may be a connection that you have not been able to deeply explore with one another. And your person, because they're feeling all of this heaviness, it's almost like they're projecting this onto you, okay? They haven't even really sat down and, and kind of dug deep on what it is that they're feeling. It's almost like they need this confirmation for you. This this is what they do a lot of times in the connection, especially when there's this underlying energy of fear. But where they are right now, they want, now that they have been, now that it's been confirmed that you both are feeling the same kind of emotions, you both are tapped into the same level of intensity and also that they even have this information because they are your divine masculine, now it's like game on for them. This is a total game changer, okay? Very, very powerful energy. It's like they also needed to get to the root of what was standing in a way to them truly seeing you inside out. So the parts of you that you were holding back, they have access to them now, and they're going to show you that you're safe with them, okay? This is such a beautiful energy coming through here. Your masculine wants you to know that you are there as divine feminine and they want you to act like it. And this means trusting them with all of you. So this message is directly for a feminine who may have been holding back, maybe because you felt as if your person wasn't prepared to know how you really feel. This is no longer the case. They're at a place right now where they're carrying this very sacred part of your journey that may be a little triggering, but it's also a deeper form of intimacy for them, okay? This is what they're craving right now. And you may be feeling this energy as well, Divine Feminine. So if you've been feeling just this overall change, like something is coming on the horizon, like something is shifting, for some of you, you felt this, you know, almost overnight. Your connection is definitely under the energy of exposure, but it's only to bring you both to the ultimate truth so that you can move your connection forward. And this energy is really the theme of 2023. 
there will be a lot of massive shifts that tap directly into your connection in an attempt to kind of keep the energy balance both in the 3D and in the 5D, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and end the reading here. If you resonated with this message, please be sure to hit the like button on the way out as it really helps me to tap into your energies for the readings. Also, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel and I will see you all in the next video. Bye. Bye. Bye.